Yes, 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 yes. Back again on this one. I'm telling you, it is what it is. When it rains, it pours heavily. It's pouring heavily at this club right now. Talking about Chelsea FC. It's going to be loud. It's loud enough at the Stamford Bridge. Something is happening to this guy, this main man, Enzo Fernandez, in trouble. Oh my goodness. Clear reaction taking place right now upon this man who is messing up on the social media. You don't forget. Don't do that. Don't do that. Kick again the racism. That's why we are here tonight. Let me bring on this person. I'm talking about prop. Prop is a Chelsea fan. To the call. How's the camp of Chelsea fan feeling? But for us, this is Intercontinental Sports TV. They call me the Don. The Don is building. Please punch the like on the video. Subscribe to the channel. And also, what are you waiting for? Share this video. Let's cook. Let's cook. Let's cook. Let me welcome this man. Prof, fire on the mountain. Talk to me. You're alive. Hey, yo, the Don. Uh, good evening, everybody. It's Prof here uh, for Nigeria. It's good to be back on the show on the Hotspot Trend. Yeah, there's breaking news about uh, what Enzo Fernandez. Well, Enzo Fernandez is the face of hmm. this breaking news. It's the whole, almost the whole Argentine, Argentine players in their coach uh, after hmm. the win again, after the Copa America win. You know, singing and dancing uh, the derogatory words. Uh, you know, that is that is racist in uh, in nature, French and something. So we're here to, to, to talk about it and already condemn that act uh, and, uh, and it's and it's play. Uh, All right. All right, prof, let's start with this. French Football Federation is has already filed legal complaint and also Chelsea Club statement which says Chelsea Football Club finds all forms of this discriminatory behavior completely unacceptable we are proud to be a diverse inclusive club where people from all over the cultures communities and identities feel welcome i'm going to ask you prof what do you think about this whole saga as a chelsea fan yeah i mean i i looked at the the, the message the, the club statement by chelsea you know properly just to see um you know if it was well thought of and uh it wasn't this AI generated messages, and yeah, to see it, you know, they, they, they factored in the fact there that Enzo Fernandez has also apologized. I, I think this list is not complete, this um, statement is incomplete. They factored in the fact that he has apologized and that they will deal with the issues internally when it comes back. Uh, for me, like I said, it's a disgrace. Uh, what the, the what Enzo Fernandez and his and his uh, teammates did and the coach, I think for me, yeah, there's a little bit of naivety, a little bit of ignorance, and also uh, uh, they need to be educated properly because about these things, you know, you don't some of these words, some of these songs they chant, they think it's just the surface level, you know, they don't understand that it cuts deep, it cuts deeper than that. It is way way deeper than that uh, to the people who are affected. So they need to be really educated about this and be dealt more importantly, be dealt. Properly, I think a huge uh, uh, fine, if not a ban or something, should be given to these players who are found culpable of of, uh, of singing and chanting racist chants towards towards the French national team. I think I think even the fine will not be enough at this, at this stage because we've seen this this happen time and time again, and then they get fined, but the fine doesn't do anything to these players because it's money, and they all are very rich. They can afford to lose. Uh, some hundreds of thousands of pounds here and there. So I think, yeah, I think that a more stern uh, uh, um, a consequence should be should be given to these players uh, that are found uh, um, culpable of of uh, of, uh, of thinking this racist chance to the French national team. Prof, I'm going to ask you one thing: what kind of uh, discipline should be given to this guy? Because you've been mentioned about uh, if it is money, they can afford it. Um, do you think that's enough? You know, this is Premier League coming up, uh, season is coming soon, and. Uh, if the club says, okay, we've done this, what about the fans? What about the media? How do you think club, the club, Chelsea, should handle this situation? Yeah, um, first, of, first of all, I've seen some pundits, um, you know, agitating for, for Chelsea to probably even put Enzo Fernandez on the transfer okay. list. Like I said, <laughs> let's not forget, Enzo Fernandez is not the only player on that. Only player, yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah, there are a lot of players on that so on that so i think we should i think we should not make him the uh the just description the goat. yeah we shouldn't skip goat him, all right because he was the one who brought out the phone and the put phone. it on social media and mm. so if not for him we don't we don't even know that things like that songs like that are being chanted 
Oh, yeah, I, I agree. You shouldn't have brought it out on social media. It should be well self-aware. But even he shouldn't even have been singing the song in the first place. They shouldn't have been singing the song in the first place. So for me, the 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 the, the, the punishment that I think would be okay. I think they should obviously obviously uh they would find him, and then maybe uh mm. sort of you know uh, community service. Community it service. Be, yeah, make it a good sweep. Involved. Yeah, make a good sweep. You should be involved in uh, the uh, you know the, the the kick it out. And all these programs that are that have been established to, to kick out racism, you should be actively involved in all of them. You should be almost almost be the face of it in England to let people see that yes, yeah, he's actually sold on on uh, on on kicking out racism. And uh, yeah, maybe maybe I don't know I don't know maybe what are, what are the punishment Chelsea can take, but I think they would go as as finding him or even maybe costing him some games. Might not play get to play some games and all that. Mm. So yeah, but but to 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 say that it should be sold or be or be you know be 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 uh have his contract terminated is a huge huge asset to this club and let's not forget that these people uh i mean i'm talking about the owners of these clubs they've invested hugely in, in players huge. like as a well yeah. yeah for a hundred million pounds so it's an asset to the club and uh, <laughs> how many businessmen are, are willing to be an asset of that so i think he should be given punishment uh and uh yeah and she should remorse to come into the when he comes back to Cobham to the to stanford bridge he should fit all of this uh, aggrieved teammates like uh, like of Fofana, Adeshile, Okoku, you know, the, the, the French national, uh, the French nationals in, in Chelsea should face them. You should most apologize warm heartedly, whole heartedly, you know, that you know about it and, and let them and hopefully they can forgive them and they uh, and they can all come together. But it's going to be, uh, yeah. for me, it's going to be a huge task on a I tell for, you. for for Eska. I mean, the the, the, the the coach, you know, make sure that he, he, he settles this is his first big test. Because then this can easily stay in the season that has not even yep. started yet. It can derail. It can cause a, a serious uh, distractions for, for 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 a season that was that is looking optimistic. So I think uh, it's the one that just should really handle well internally. Hmm. All right, all right, Prof. I want to say big thank you to you uh, for showing up on this one. Thank you so much, yeah. bro. I appreciate. It. Thank you. All right, people. This is how far we can go tonight. Uh, Please smash the like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and also follow us on all our social media handles. What are you waiting for? I'm telling you, when it rains, it pours. On this start, I say thank you so much. Bye for now. <laughs>